hello everyone welcome to my channel in today's video i'm going to be reviewing xrs beauty hair or chris beauty hair whatever you want to call it um and inside they give you a bunch of goodies they give you eyelashes they give you the extenders for the elastic band a nice comb as well as some hair clips pretty cute So the wig that I purchased was 22 inches and it is 200 density and it is straight Brazilian hair. It's, it has a nice, nice, nice texture to it. Um, I'm just showing you guys the knots. The knots are tiny. You hear me? Like they're tiny. <laughs> like they're perfect. Like I've been needing a wig like this like the lace is definitely immaculate i can't even i don't even know a greater word to say for this this lace like it's the bomb dot motherfucking com <laughs> so i'm just showing you guys the inside of the wig um the places where you would connect the elastic band to and they also have clips in the back in the side and like on top I eventually cut those out because I just don't like them. <laughs> so right now I'm just showing you guys. Um, me getting ready to prep the wig for me to dye it. So I just put it on a mannequin head like so. And then I take my got to be glue spray. Which I'm going to show you guys. And I spray that lace like nobody's business. Okay. Like I spray layers on layers on layers on layers. <laughs> and to be honest when I think about it you don't even need to because the net the knots eventually um dye black um anyway so I want to go back in and bleach the knots but just you know if you're scary for tinting the lace more so um you can do that and that will protect it um so I used the Revlon color silk um, hair dye you can get that from Walmart Target it's like two dollars and seventy cents at most um, and I'm just prepping those right here I have my container I got my container from Walmart probably like five bucks um, just pour the hair dye inside of the container I only use two um, boxes of the dye I feel like two is perfect two is just you know the perfect color you get the perfect color result using two and right now I'm just taking my time dying, dipping the hair inside the water. Just take your time with it like me. Um, I'm not a hairstylist. I watched hundreds of videos, like thousands. I watch hair videos every day, y'all. <laughs> I can't even make this up. Be just because like I really do like hair and you know, you just have to practice. If you have an older wig that you're, you know, you don't really care about messing up just try that first before you get you know a wig that you really really want um but right now i'm just taking a, a brush and you know trying to make sure that it's come through but like i said take your time with it dip the ends and then slowly just work your way down y'all can see i sprayed that lace like nobody business y'all <laughs> i'm so scary <laughs> i did not want to tint the lace but the lace did not tint y'all will see in the end so yeah um just make sure you make just make sure you submerge the whole wig so eventually you do have to dip the whole wig inside because you want to make sure that you're getting the tips of the hair dyed and whatnot so just take your time with it it's a trial and error thing but the wig came out nice y'all i love dyeing my hair black now <laughs> It has to be jet black. I cannot do nothing else. <laughs> so I'm literally going through all my wigs and dyeing them black. <laughs>
so once i feel like i've submerged the wig enough inside of the dye um i'm just going to take the clips that came in the box and clip the hair together and then like clip it onto the container so that the whole wig doesn't like fall inside of the the water dye um just to prevent the lace from tinting and whatnot um but y'all i'm sorry I, I i had to put a, a trash bag on my sink because i'm scared <laughs> i didn't want to dye my sink black y'all i'm telling you i'm a mess when it comes to this hair and stuff um and i'm just using the conditioner that came inside of the dye um just to replenish the moisture in the hair make sure that hair is soft silky and smooth and i also use um the silicone mix to um make sure the hair is super super soft and smooth and just retain that moisture and whatnot because we don't like dry hair <laughs> um and once i make sure that it's fully conditioned i go and put my wig inside of a plastic bag and y'all gonna see that in a second and i just let it sit you know 15 minutes nothing too long just want to make sure that you know gets that moisture back inside the hair and then once i let it sit for 15 minutes i come back and i wash everything out with even more conditioner like i said y'all we want this hair to be buttery soft smooth melting in your hands y'all see that look at the color y'all i be pressed like i really be <laughs> y'all if y'all actually hear the shit that i'm saying as i'm washing this wig y'all be like this girl is crazy as shit y'all i'll be I be going off <laughs> but yeah I'm just taking the conditioner and just trying to rinse out all of that dye and stuff that's the part I kind of struggle with like I after a while I get lazy I'm beginning for like washing all of that dye out I really don't <laughs> but yeah it's like I said taking more conditioner just you know rinsing it and washing it making sure that it's better y'all that hair is so soft it's so soft it's so soft it's so soft I promise y'all it's probably the best it's this is definitely best hair i've had so far and i feel like i got a lot of wigs probably not more not probably not as more than you know the average but i definitely have a little collection and this is the best one so once i you know pretty much get it all washed out i'm going to show you guys the hair y'all and it's dyed jet black the knots are so invisible even though they are now dyed back black <laughs> but i'm going to be showing y'all the process of me bleaching these knots y'all it took me a while i wish somebody would have told me like you'll die when you bleach the knots like you'll choke the bleach it's strong wear your mask we wear a mask anyway <laughs> y'all i be choking with that bleach it's not a game Yeah, so I'm just showing y'all the hair. And it's a black baby. Look at dots. Buttery smooth. It's so soft. Yes, we love it. Knots are tiny. Undetectable. What's going on here? It's some really good lace. But the lace isn't... It's not like super thin, but it's not thick. Like I've had laces that are thick as fuck, <laughs> and this lace isn't too thick, but it's definitely you know not super super thin. So it doesn't like rip easily or anything like that. Cause I hate that too. All right, girl, you're showing them more than enough. Come on, let's go. camera ain't trying to focus okay <laughs> so y'all know how y'all have seen i know y'all have seen them i don't know if y'all seen all the videos that y'all can see on how to bleach these knots the best way i can describe it is think of a cake think of a cake with all the little crumbs falling off like you know how you just, you just want to be really light handed with it like you don't want none of the crumbs to show when that cake is the same way you do with the wig, you want to make sure that you are using gentle, gentle applications for this bleach. And I always start in the back of the wig and then work my way up to the front. 
um, because I just want the knots to be bleached the more in the back versus the front. Because the front always bleached fast for some reason. I don't know why. But yeah, y'all, the knots are so small. So you don't even need to leave the bleach on for long. And I forgot to show y'all what kind of bleaching products I'm using. But I'm using 30 Developer. 30 Volume Developer. Y'all, I don't know what it's called. But I know it's the number 30 on the bottom. And then the bleach is like, the, the powder is like Clarisol powder. Y'all can go to the beauty supply store and get that. Do not buy that shit off Amazon. It's too expensive. Um, yeah, but just take your time with it. Make sure that you don't press hard because you will bleach the hair. But I bleach the hair a little, little bit, but not like it's not too noticeable. Yes, you better ice that wig, girl. Look at me. I'm so proud of me, y'all. I actually am doing this shit. Y'all, I hate doing my hair. I promise you. I promise you. Wow, look at that. So, yeah, I left it in for like 15 minutes. Um, I'm washing the bleach out. Uh, make sure y'all wear gloves. You do not want to burn yourself. Yeah, so just wash that bleach out. You don't need you don't need to leave it in for long. I promise you, you don't, cause the knots are tiny, so they're gonna bleach really quickly. Versus them thick ass knots and them other wigs, we gotta leave the bleach in for like an hour. You don't gotta do that with this wig. So I'm putting that purple shampoo on that wig, on that lace, make it do what it do. Y'all know, I I just be copying people. I don't know what the fuck this is for. No, I do know. I'm supposed to help with, um, I guess, get rid of the brassiness. But, y'all, I don't give a to be honest. <laughs> but, yeah, so, um, I do have a video of me installing the hair. If y'all want to see that, let me know. If not, I'm not going to post it. Because, like, there's too many people in here that know how to throw on a wig really bomb. Y'all need to see me struggle. Yes, y'all don't need to see me struggle. But I'm going to post some pictures and videos of my hair because my hair was cute. Like, it was, where's the lace? It was none. It was scalp. It was giving me scalp. I love it. Um, Thank you. It's at really Andrew because that's who I saw the video from first. But I know there's other videos. But I saw her video. I saw the wig on her. I was like, I need that. I need that. Worth every penny. Worth every motherfucking penny. Like, buy this wig. Chris X, Chris X Beauty. Y'all will see me again. I will put the price of the wig down below. If y'all see someone that have a code, use that code. But I think they do have, um, you can get like 80% off your wig if you use a code. But yeah, just check the website. I'm going to put the website in the description box as well. They are top-notch quality. Top, uh, they are top-notch quality here, I will say that. The shedding, it's very minimal, which I'm surprised because all my wigs shed a lot. Um, they shed a lot. But this wig, it doesn't shed as much, so that's that's a good plus. But all wigs shed, okay? So I'm not saying the wig don't shed. It just doesn't shed a lot. Um, What else did I not cover in this thing? Yeah, so um, this is the end of the video, y'all. <laughs> Thank you all for watching this video. Uh, if y'all want more hair videos, let me know. Um, yeah, y'all. Y'all stay cute. And I'll see y'all in my next video. Bye.